COVID-19 took the parents of Long Island siblings. Their Hempstead community has responded with overloving care and love. CBS 2's Jennifer McLogan spoke with this brother and sister who are grieving and grateful. Hey, there are only two people who had the luxury of being the children. That was me and my sister. And it's like, they're awesome parents. COVID-19 claimed the lives of a couple deeply in love, Ernesto and Sandra Lemus, leaving their grief-stricken children parentless. The house just feels like really empty and then you kind of feel lonely. Sandra, a vivacious stay-at-home mom, Ernie, the hard-working beloved chef at a Mineola restaurant, tested positive on the same day and felt sick enough to go to the hospital. The siblings, Joalmo and Sandra, local college students, never dreamt it would be the last time they'd see their parents alive. In theory, I didn't even get to say, like, goodbye. Soon, distress calls from the medical staff. I was on the phone with the doctor, like, and I just started crying. Sandra had slipped away. I'm over here crying my soul out over mom. They relied on their deep faith, overwhelming response from their church, and former high school community Kellenberg. Yet two weeks later, another unexpected loss, Ernesto's organs shut down. That was the eighth day of the rosary for my mom. So a lot of people were coming because it was towards the end, and they found out, so at least we got someone to comfort us. Ernie was just part of the family here. It's just a rough, tough time for everyone here. We decided to do was just go fund me and try to make something good out of it. Fundraising for funeral expenses and the children's futures. At times it's like you're just angry because you're like they're not even here and I'm 22. My sister's 18. Ernesto Lemus will be buried Monday at Queen of Peace Cemetery next to his beloved wife Sandra. Another time it's like all right well you know they did pass away but look at all the people helping us. The community and like the love that it's given us is really nice. Strength to overcome agony. From Hempstead, Long Island, Jennifer McLogan, CBS 2 News.